kisses. Yes! Uh-huh. We just hit 10,000 miles. Holy crap! Oh, I just went through the most craziest experience so far in this challenge. I'm good. Good morning. Welcome to day six. I am up with the sun. It's really bright on this side. Um, currently in New Mexico. Yesterday was a little bit rough. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it above my head, but I did an iron butt <laughs> unintentionally, but uh, Today I am in New Mexico and headed to I'm in Las Vegas, New Mexico, and I am headed to um, Pretty much Hendersonville, Las Vegas area for my 10k service today. That's my only time crunch, is that I have to be there before six o'clock to do um, the service and just to make sure I'm not taking too much of their time because it's a Saturday evening and they're willing to do this at Henderson, um, Harley Davidson. So I gotta get my butt in gear, keep on track for today. Left at, got up at four, because I went to bed at one. <laughs> Got up at four, left by quarter to five, pretty much. So I'm on the road. It is six o'clock right now and headed to Albuquerque, New Mexico, Arizona, Needles, California, and then up to Vegas area. So follow along with me today. Should be a breeze compared to yesterday. God, I hope so. Yesterday was fun. So, all right, see you guys shortly. Mexico. I think it's actually Casablanca or near that area. Had some breakfast with some granola that I brought along with me. I never realized how much I appreciated crossing my legs <laughs> and pretty much laying vertical, horizontal I mean. Um, I am on schedule for the schedule that I had planned because of my 10k service today. But Garmin has me rerouting over two hours to Needles, California. My Google Maps has me still taking that route. But I think there's a complete road closure and I am hoping that I can just do a quick detour of maybe say a half an hour. I don't know how much, I don't, I don't know the roads out here. Uh, but. That's the plan. I'm still on track to get there before six o'clock for uh, Vegas area. I'm breaking out here really bad in my face. Oh, too much helmet time. And my tires might need to be looked at too. You can tell what kind of riding I'm doing chain is definitely I'm gonna have to put some more lube on it just to make sure going through that rainstorm in Texas yesterday was a little rough on the bike okay time to finish up keep pushing
lull that hardest part of the day is at like one o'clock for me and I hit that like nothing I listened to was gonna do it for me absolutely nothing <sighs> I'm so thankful it's raining right now because right over there is some of the fires that apparently had road closed this morning but I'm fingers crossed opening back up <laughs> to get me over to the, the other side of I-40. God, I hope so, but that's crazy. You go from like one extreme to the next, and so yesterday it was just downpour torrential rain, and today it's forest fires. Wow. You see everything in this ride, that's for sure. Heavy smoke in road work one mile ahead, lane closure. In Belmont, low visibility. I don't think I'm going to Belmont, am I? God, I hope not. It's kind of fun that I'm riding part of Route 66. Who oh, is hot? I'm in Santa Fe, Ash Fork, maybe. I don't know where I am. <laughs> oh, I just went through the most craziest experience so far in this challenge. They've shut down a bunch of the area and could have been the highways too. Well, I went through that entire smoke and it was crazy. Of course my GoPro battery died just as I was about to, you know, start the whole thing. Never fails. But I tried to get some with my hero session that I could pick up because I wasn't going to be the one that just pull off on the side of the road to turn the GoPro on to get the footage. Like, I needed to get out of there. I don't need to be in the smoke for any reason. So, I am headed to Needles, California next. I got 156 miles. I believe I am ooh, a little bit behind schedule half an hour schedule so I might I'm gonna have to book it but I have to be in Henderson for the 10k service by 6 o'clock I was gonna try to do 5:30, but well you know how that went never fails but yeah absolutely crazy experience I'm not sure if I want to do that again but wow it was crazy If I look the way I do and I'm shaking the way I am, it's because it's 117 degrees here in Needles, California. It's the Mojave Desert. Duh, Whitney. Why did you schedule this one at 4 o'clock in the afternoon? I like stripped down, took everything off. I'm gonna sit here for another half an hour and then I have to go up. Oh, yeah. Why am I doing this to myself? I'm good. It's worth it. It's worth it. It's the hottest it's gonna get for the entire challenge. Just gotta. Suck it up. <sighs> if you park in the garage, if you park in the parking garage over there, yeah, the bike will be cooler. Ah. In the morning. Well, it's nighttime. Never mind, it won't matter. Thank you. See you guys. One K service is done. Thank you, Henderson, Harley Davidson, for taking time out of your Saturday night to get this done in time. So it doesn't throw me for a loop having to ride later at night 
Oh, it's awesome. You guys are the best. Got brand new tires on this dang thing. Yeah, yeah. I feel more confident in it because I looked at the back tire and the front tire and went, uh, okay. But I'm in Vegas, find my hotel. Call it good. I'm just cruising in neutral. Rip, rip. I mean, you can't hurt anything, right? <laughs> 